gentlemen and ladies, ladies and gents, we just want you all to hush for just a moment as Usher and Obama. Every day wakes up in his million dollar home, his life is like a video, the only reality he knows. He jumps inside of his hundred thousand dollar car, cruising up the boulevard, driving past people living hard. Complains about the gas prices, but still supports the war. He complains about his six figure salary tax to feed the poor. He doesn't understand the homeless, doesn't think it's genocide. That millions died from three lethal letters, so he does shit to make it better. And I'm thinking. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Hush. I've liked this song since the day that it first came out. You just don't say nothing. Now, see, this is the version without Obama. But I think Mr. Usher did a very good job with this song. So while we let Usher play in the background, see, it's hard to mess with YouTube because I can't see the volume. So we're going to. All right. What we want to talk about, ladies and gentlemen, is there is something there is something I'm trying to do and I've been hampered a little bit because the system is retaliating against me and I want to show you we're going to use YouTube to show you give me one second we're gonna we're gonna stop Usher because he's saying don't say nothing the next time I'm going to play the other video, okay, the one with Obama in it, this is the one without Obama, and the one with Obama I think is a much better version. Now, don't get me wrong, this one is okay. Okay. Now, I'm going to pause you guys while I look for what I'm looking for. Ladies and gentlemen, this is what I'm looking to do. You see this home right here? Not so much this high foundation. I don't need to do the high foundation, but this is what I'm looking to do. And literally to pretty much have solar panels at the top. Okay. Now, this home right here is $6,000. Okay. It's a modular and it is something I construct. This is the structure. Okay, and of course it will, now this is a loft area where one can place a bed and that's your frame. Okay, and this is the different so-called floor plans. I'm looking to see if there's any more pictures. This is not the only one. This is... Um, this is one model. So let's see if I can. Yeah, I'm not really interested in the floor plans because I can always change the floor plans. Okay, these are the type of pictures I'm looking for. Okay. And I'm a simple person. Okay, so I can do something like this. Uh, I had somebody ask me, well, what am I going to do about the foundation and all of that stuff? What do you mean? I have no problem putting this on stilts until I'm able to build the foundation. What I'm looking for is just the structure. I can take care of the water storage and I can take care of the septic because I've done this before. Okay, but right now I had the funds to take care of this that was taken away during this last vacation. 
Um, when I did that vacation, I did that primarily to help people. This thing cost $7,000. I have 2.2 acres of land that I am, um, well, I like this going with PayPal credit, but I can't afford PayPal credit. They won't accept me. I promise you. But let's get back to, uh, and remember, we have our issue with PayPal. PayPal don't like me. Get, would you close that? I didn't ask you to be doing that. All right. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, again, it's not the only home like this. This is not the actual home that I'm looking at, but I probably will. I probably will be looking at this one a little bit more in depth because I do like its structure. And I like the skylight sort of feel that it has. Okay. But this is why I put the donation button up there because I need a place for me to park my hat so that I can be a little bit more at peace to do the research, give you the information you need. So the donation button, I do apologize that I'm going to have to mention that that's underneath. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, many of you have been donating and I appreciate it. And it's not the size of the donation that I appreciate. I appreciate you taking the time to consider this person because he does appreciate it. Ladies and gentlemen, I say thank you. I may not be able to thank all of you at the exact same time, but I do say thank you. And many of you will receive a response from me. I don't want to have that uh, stupid generated response that's done by the system because that doesn't mean anything. But you will get a response from me. And so just bear with me because there's so much I'm doing. Uh, redoing those contracts, that's going to take some effort. So I just have to make sure it gets done right. So bear with me. Okay. Um, do want to thank all of you for taking the time. I just want to let you know what the idea is, what the thought is. This is what your donations will help me to do for myself. Now remember, homes like this is what TTOPP will be putting together. Not so much, you know, I, I wasn't planning on going so high up as far as the height. And I wanted the other shape, but the Water Nest 100 is what I was looking at originally for TTOPP. And it's not set in stone. I put in Water Nest 100. Wait till you see the price on the Water Nest 100. It was originally 14000 for the Water Nest 100, a self-contained hall. Um, sorry, I got to put Water Nest together because uh, eBay wants to be like Google. So, and we'll be ending this video shortly. I just wanted to say again, this is what I'm aiming for. And I would have the funds, but let's just say, oh, come on. And I know they have the water nest. Okay. Hold on. I'll do it this way. Let me put you all on pause and I'll get there. We're going to go with our new edition right now. Ladies and gentlemen, that was the first dome home. The home that I really would have appreciated was this one but it's twice as much the thing is this home when you consider the loft it's 3,000 square feet okay so the 45 feet in diameter 90 feet in circumference diameter is half a circumference okay diameter is a line straight across circumference is the circular distance around total surface distance is 3,000 square feet when you consider the loft that this house has. Let me show you some of the design. This is where I was headed. But like I said, $7,000 in property that is missing, not lost. They've not reported it lost. They said it's missing. They can't locate it. So now I have to file an insurance claim. 
and let the insurance company deal with these idiots uh, at that facility. This is what I have to go through. So I'll show you this, uh, this home. And so that's about $7,500 in total, plus the $2,400 that they took for restitution that they have to pay back, which they're going to take their time doing. Then I will be, I am, a, I do have the two stimulus checks that I've not received. So that's $2,800. You see what I mean? It's not that I don't have access to the funds. And that's without me doing the work that I need to do. It's just, again, without focusing on that, I'm focusing on this. I don't know why it didn't open up the page when I clicked on it. So let's see if we can get it to go there. Okay, there we go. So this, this is not an actual home. What do you mean it's not an actual home? This is a concept picture. This is uh, graphics. This is not. <laughs> this is not real. The tree is not real. This is not real. This is just a picture, okay? But this is the design, okay? This is the way the square footage works, okay? Now you see right here. This is leading up to the loft area. This gives you the second floor view. This gives you the first floor view. Okay, that's why you can't see this area here. It's because of this. Okay, because of the loft. That gives you your 3,000 square feet. And this right here, I think, does add to the home because it allows that light to get in. But see, like I said, I want solar panels on mine. And the reason for the solar panels is because I want it to be self-contained. This is how they are envisioning it to look. Now, of course, I would never do anything like this. That is tacky to me. Having strings coming down from the sky. Well, what would you do? Have a light in the middle of the floor? Your mama. I would have the electric in the floor. Well, what if you and the mopping and everything, and the mop gets into the electric, and you, you get electric in the cubie? No, because this is. Don't worry about it. Okay, I definitely will take care of it. Okay, because ain't no mopping when there is a rug on the floor. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Is this is is this our Shirley? This is Shirley, y'all. This is Shirley Murdoch, y'all. And I know y'all ain't heard from Shirley in a while. Man, that woman can blow. And I know many of y'all ain't heard from Shirley in a long time. This is them actually constructing the home. Without you, my life ain't too and this was my song. I, but you say every song is your song. You better believe it. Told you I'm a music connoisseur. There's nothing. There's no way. No way. I can go on without you. All right. I show you that one. This was the home originally that I was looking at because it was on water. I wanted to take this and put it on land and do it like the modular homes you just saw. But this home, which was self-contained, it was $14,000 when it first came out. Okay, watch this. We do four. Oh no, it already did it. It already did it. Let's get, let's get rid of that. Watch this. I want to want to let you show how greedy these people have gotten. They went from four thousand dollars to five hundred thousand uh, dollars. Excuse me, fourteen thousand to five hundred thousand dollars for that home. That home is not worth five hundred thousand dollars. But do you see fourteen thousand dollars to five hundred thousand dollars? I ain't got time for that type of stupidity. So I can take this home. Well, no, this is twice as much as the other. So I can take the original home I showed you. 
and put solar panels on and do the exact same thing that that home does. Because most people don't understand what a home like this, the electricity is not that hard to install. Okay? Because you can run the lines for the electricity, you can run the lines for the plumbing. All of that's already done. You can set up the solar panels and run the lines for the solar panels. So you can do everything 12 volt. There is, you can do it all the same as you do a mobile home as opposed to doing it 110 volts. There's no reason for me to do a home that's 110 volts when I can go 12 volt and have everything running off a of 12 volt. That means I can run everything off of 12 volts in the solar panels. Make it completely efficient, run LED lights. I've already, people, what I'm trying to say is I've already done the solar panel thing. I've already done the septic tank thing. I did that all myself without anybody coming and helping me. Okay, and eventually I will extend this thing out because I don't mind building a side structure because I've done that as well. But this is my intent. The fact that this plus the land is equal. So the $7,000 plus $7,000, literally the land that the two acres of land here in California is the exact same price. Just didn't realize that until now. So that's what your donations are going to help me to do while I help you with this getting out of debt thing and helping you with your financial issues with the knowledge that I have. Okay, if you will take a look at this video, 17 minutes, the other video I did just before this was a little over an hour and a half. That's how much of my time this takes. All right, what I want to do is I want to let all of you go. I want to say thank you. Uh, and I want to continue to thank all of you who do donate with the donation link that's underneath. And Please understand that the eon.tv site will be complete as soon as I get the time. I'm so sorry. I am working on SAA's website in the contracts right now, and that's the most important, getting that out to you guys. We're going to not go with Patrice Ruffin. We're going to end the video now. Uh, Y'all know who Patrice Ruffin is, but we're going to let her play a different day. Thank you all for tuning in. And um, Rob Ryder, who talks about helping to keep the lights on, you guys will help me to get myself situated after the sacrifice that was just made. And again, you don't owe me anything, none of you. I didn't do this for finances, but those of you who've been asking over the years for an opportunity to donate, the link is underneath the video. Thank you. Have a good day, all of you.